Hello friends, uh, welcome to Learners Planet. Friends, in this session of permutation and combination, we'll be taking more problems based on arrangement of letters and numbers, right? In the previous session, we discussed some problems based on arrangement of letters, right? What happens when uh, all the letters of a particular word are unique and we have to rearrange them that we have discussed in the previous session and uh, one or two problems we discussed even on uh, when the letters are repeated in a particular word right so in this session i'll be taking more such problems uh, when the repetition of letters is there then we'll switch over to the another topic right so let's begin now let's take uh, this question to brush up the concept which we discussed in the previous session uh, see how many words can be formed from the letters of the word daughter so that the walls always come together the first case and the walls never come together the other case right so how do we approach this problem one two three four five six seven eight eight letters are there and there is no repetition at all so if there is no condition then um in all there will be eight factorial words with or without meaning they will be formed from the letters of the word daughter right so 8 factorial the total total number of words without any condition now let's come to the uh, first case when all the walls come together now it's how many walls are there it's 1 and 2 and this 3 u so a u and e three walls are there and remaining five are consonants and what we want we want the three walls to come together that means it's something like this right so i uh, write down the remaining letters now if i want them to be together what i'll take what i'll do i'll treat it as a single letter now i have one two three four five six six letters which can be arranged in six factorial ways right now these three letters to, should be together but it is not necessary that they would be in this order only so the mutual arrangement inside this circle a u e can be arranged in three factorial ways right so six factorial into three factorial right you got my point this is one two three four five six letters they can be arranged in six factorial ways then inside this circle because i treat this is as a single letter now inside the circle they can be mutually arranged in three factorial ways because uh, three factorial ways in all these ways they will be together but the order will be changed and we are asked that they should come together right not necessarily to be in a certain order right so six factorial into three factorial your answer will be it's four three zero right so these are the cases when all the walls are together now uh, suppose we have to find out all the vowels never come together right so in all we have eight factorial ways to rearrange the letters of the word daughter and in these cases all the vowels are together so in the remaining cases that means eight factorial minus four three two zero the vowels will never be together now what's the value of 8 factorial that is um, that we have to calculate 7, 6 factorial is 720 7 factorial is 5040 so it's i don't remember the value of 8 factorial so it's 5040 into 8 minus 4320 so we have to calculate that so it is 36000 right maybe if, if you are appearing for any competitive exam the uh, in your options maybe this uh, format is given maybe 8 factorial minus 6 factorial into 3 factorial is given whatever the thing is ultimately the concept will remain same so finally what we have done first of all we calculated how many letters uh, how many words will be formed that is 8 factorial in this case all the walls are together so these are six factorial into three factorial cases in the this case all the walls uh, never come together that means all the three walls should not be together maybe two are together and one is apart but all the three are not together now the one more question can be framed that none of the vowels should be together right 
so that can also be done right now suppose uh, uh, so uh, here two questions are given but i just would like to discuss the third case also when not even two walls are together right so this is the third case and the answer would be different now how do we approach that particular problem right uh, so we have three walls and we have five consonants first of all uh, we have eight places and what i do i arrange these five consonants in the first case now five places are there i'm just arranging these five consonants five places are there and five letters are there so they will be arranged in five factorial manner right i just take one of the example only for the, like simplicity it's d g h t and r right so uh, this way this is just one uh, of the arrangements so these are the in all it will be five factorial arrangement right because they can be rearranged rearranged right now since we want uh, the letters the walls should not be together i have to fit in the vowels in the uh, in between the consonants so how many choices do i have one two three four five and six right so may maybe a is here o, u is here e is here or they are taking any places between the consonants right so now i have one two three four five six places but i have just three vowels now what i have to do what i will do is i'll select the three places and how do i do that six places i want three places so six c three now i selected the three places right all the combinations i have taken so i selected the three places now in these three places three letters can be arranged in three factorial ways right so in all this will be your answer okay now i just would repeat it once again we don't want i'm discussing the third case we don't want even the two vowels are together that means first of all i'm arranging the consonants like this right five consonants can be arranged in five factorial ways then if we don't want the walls even two walls to come together i have to fit them in between the consonants so i have these many options one two three four five six right but i have three vowels only so i need to select three places any three places maybe this 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 maybe this 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 maybe this this and this whatever right so i need to select three places and these three places the three vowels can be arranged in three factorial ways right so in all my answer is five factorial into 63 into three factorial right so it is 120 into this is 6 into 5 into 4 by 3 factorial into 3 factorial so 6 5s are 30 13 to 4 1, 1, 120 that means 120 square that is 144 4, that is 12 square and two zeros so 144 4, two zeros cases will be there when not even two walls are together right so i hope you are clear about all the three cases the problem is really important to understand the concept of arrangement so if you are not clear do revise all the three problems right